When I got my new apartment, the first two things I wanted to be done was wiring my office with CAT6 cable and running speaker cables from the entertainment center unit to bathrooms. I moved in a few months ago and finally got around installing ceiling speakers. In this video, I'll show you how to do it yourself. But first, let's talk speakers. For the bigger bathroom, I decided to go with the Magnet ICQ62. These are two-way speakers with a frequency response ranging from 34Hz to 26kHz. The 16cm woofer has aluminum membrane, while the tweeter rests in a socket that allows 30 degrees adjustment. What I really like about this is that the bezels are reduced to minimum so they nicely blend in when installed. ICQ62 features two switches, enabling bumping up or turning down high and low frequencies by 3 decibels. For my outer bathroom, which is a bit smaller, I got something different. The ICQ262 is a very similar construction to the ICQ62, but it's actually a stereo speaker. It has two tweeters and it's capable of receiving left and right channel signals. Other than that, the design is pretty much the same. I'm no expert, but you can easily tell that these magnets are high quality speakers. I bought them at Sonar TPL and I did get a discount for sharing with you this information. Let's move on to the installation. What you need is a basic metal detector, a drywall knife, a wire stripper, a screwdriver, and a pencil. Prepare the cattle template that comes with each speaker. Establish approximate mounting point and swipe the ceiling with the metal detector looking for support beams. You will need a clean area large enough to accommodate the speaker. Once you find the right spot, use the template to draw the circle. Cut through drywall using a drywall knife. Don't rush it and mind that it will be a bit messy, so have a vacuum cleaner ready. After cleaning up, get back on the ladder and extract the wires that your contractor have left for you. Strip the isolation, take the speaker, push the wire connector down, insert the cable and release the connector. Do the same for the other cable, making sure that you connect the red one to the positive speaker connector and the other one to the negative. Insert the speaker through the hole, work the screws to secure the speaker in place and put the cover on. Repeat the steps to mount the second speaker. Connect the other end of the speaker wire to whatever serves you as an amplified audio source. In my case, one set of speakers is connected to the second zone output on my Pioneer receiver, while the stereo speaker in the other bathroom will be served by Hi-Fi Berry Amp Plus. In the near future, I'll be adding Bluetooth connectivity to both, so this might interest those of you who cannot wire bathroom with speakers cable. Thanks very much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.